Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. So I'm Beetle Knees and uh, yeah I'm doing another uh, Fernbus or Flixbus video today and uh, I actually did one yesterday and I uh, put it up on YouTube and within about 15 minutes I'd taken it back down again because one or two people were saying they couldn't hear my voice at all so uh, I do apologize for that. Uh, I don't know what had happened. I did actually increase the uh, sound settings of the game so whether that had anything to do with it or not I don't know but it sounded like I was in a box to be honest um, so uh, I'm going to do the same uh, kind of uh, run today though um, which is up the uh, north eastern uh, edge of Germany so uh, let's get on with it So as you can see, I am here on the uh, the map, and uh, let's just um, zoom out a little bit. Um, actually, I just realised my headset's not uh, working. Although I haven't got any sound on uh, on this particular bit, because I've turned the music down. Uh, we'll see when we get into the game, anyway. So, <clears throat> yeah, up this uh, this north uh, eastern side. So, the route I thought I would do um, because I did this route uh, or round here on uh, or over the weekend, and I thought, what a beautiful area this is round here. It was almost like being on holiday. So, uh, hence my title. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to do from uh, Albeck uh, to uh, Volgast over here. Um, and please accept my pronunciation if that is not entirely correct. So uh, I'm going to do the uh, the shuttle bus, which is uh, this one here, um, and we'll see on the next screen what uh, what bus I am using. Um, I don't think there's anything else I need to do there. So let's uh, go on to the next screen. So yeah, the bus I thought I'd do is this uh, BB one which um, I've not really uh, driven before on on the channel at least anyway I've done a little bit in private but uh, but yeah this is uh, this is the one they're quite twisty roads around that area now I do quite fancy doing them in a big bus but um, we'll do them in this one uh, and then uh, I'll do my next one perhaps uh, in one of the bigger buses um, but I do like driving around the the more kind of um, a and B roads rather than being on the motorways all the time uh, they can get a bit boring can't they so so i'll keep that uh, livery as it is uh we've got the realistic mode the today's date the time is 10 o'clock in the morning and the weather is sunny i thought since it's holiday time we'll have it as sunny weather so let's get into the game so yeah like i say apologies again about that video i don't know what happened i, I have to say I, I don't tend to check them before they go up and uh, obviously sometimes um things will happen but you tend to assume don't you that all the other videos have been been pretty much okay so uh, why is uh, or why wasn't that one i've no idea um so i don't know on that but uh, anyway hopefully this one should be hunky dory so here we are we are uh, in albeck and we need to get inside this bus don't we And just to have a quick look around here actually let's just have a look uh, there's not really an awful lot to see at this particular point but uh, it's uh, you know it look, looks a nice uh, nice little town though there's Albeck or unless it's a city I don't know it's one or the other but uh, it does look nice and um, this is what I wanted to uh, to show you guys if you've not been up this area so uh, first of all, let's uh, sort my seat out because I want to be sat a little bit further back. I like to be able to see the steering wheel, etc. So uh, that's that sorted. We'll get the engine started. And to oops, don't want neutral, do we? I want drive. Don't want that. I'll put that on by mistake. And I think that's uh, that's it for that. And we'll close the doors. We will set these up while we're here. Okay, so 
let's uh, let's get on. We'll take a left turn here. Just go across the pavement area. Looking okay, and take a little bit of a wide sweep so we can tuck ourselves in. Thank you, Chester. Go on if you're going. And yeah, I mean, when you look round here, it looks uh, it looks really, really good. Uh, you've got the church up ahead there, unless it's a cathedral. I'm not sure. It doesn't look quite big enough to be a cathedral. But it's, it looks a nice old church, definitely. Let's get outside and have a look. So how is everybody? How's everybody going? Are you uh, doing a lot of the old fern bus? Certainly seems to be very popular at the moment. And uh, I did do a train life video actually yesterday, so if you've not watched that one, take a look. Um, the news on that, if you've not seen it, is I've had to uh, go back to playing it on the Xbox because my, um, my saves weren't working again. Uh, I've had this problem two or three times before where the saves just aren't uh, syncing up with Steam for some reason uh, because I'm playing them on GeForce now and uh, yeah I don't know what's the matter with it I, I don't have the problem on any other game although I've had somebody comment that they actually do have a problem with a particular game on their Steam account so whether it has got something to do with the game I mean I was assuming it was the game because there's been so many bugs in it uh, but it, I suppose it could well be Steam the, the problem with Steam I find just quickly on uh, on that subject, is that I don't find their customer service to be particularly great. They always seem to want to pass the ball. Um, you know, even if it's something to do with their system, it's, oh no, it's not us, it's the game's fault. Uh, and it really gets my goat, to be honest, that they, they can't be bothered to, uh, to try and answer your question properly. So, uh, yeah, it's one thing uh, that really bugs me about Steam. It's never their fault. But, uh, well, yeah, whether it's the Steam uh, issue or whether it's the game issue, I don't know. I, I just don't have it on any other game, that's all. So I suppose I was kind of assuming I'm putting two or two together. But, um, so, yeah, so I'm back on the old Xbox, uh, if you watch the video, and I'm having to do my, uh, my personal game, which I set up uh, some months ago when it first came out. And look at that big thing there. I don't even work out what it is from this angle, to be honest. Love the streets, though. The streets look great, don't they? Everything looks great, to be honest. I, I'm well impressed with it. Looks absolutely beautiful. Well, yeah, as I was saying, I don't have a problem on any other game. So, uh, I, I, I don't know whose fault it is. But, yeah, back on the Xbox, I'm doing... Um, oh, police behind me. Doing my uh, personal game, which I started some time ago, so uh, I probably did a little bit more on the map. Perhaps, perhaps owned a little bit more of the map up than I did on my uh, PC version. But um... oh, oh no, what's what the heck is he doing? <laughs> Dear me, honestly, unbelievable! Just cut straight across. Why not? <laughs> Ah uh, dear. I'll get out what I wanted to say in a bit. So, uh, so yeah, uh, yeah. Where was I? I keep losing my thread. Back on uh, the old Xbox with my train life videos. So uh, anyway, uh, I'll not speak too much about that since I'm doing firm bus. But uh, sorry about that. Just having a little bit of camera fish tail in there. You're a bit close there, Mr. Policeman. Right. Anyway, let's concentrate on what we're doing here. So, uh, it's 9.51, we've got to get there for 10 o'clock, so let's see how we go. I have to say, this, uh, this little BB minibus, uh, it is very, uh, very nimble. Um, it's, you can tell that you're driving a different vehicle, it's such a different experience uh, driving this to the bigger buses. The bigger buses are 
you know, quite slow to react. I'm not, I'm not saying um, unnecessarily so. That's that's how they are. Um, and the, the nice to drive, to be honest, I've always said that. But, but this one, yeah, seems very. You can tell you're driving a smaller vehicle, definitely. Let's put it that way. Incidentally, yeah, I don't know whether anybody's seen. I've had quite a few votes on it. Uh, last time I looked, I think there was 20 odd votes. For what's your best or what's your favourite bus simulator game? And uh, yeah, I'll let you have a, a look on there. I don't, I'm not sure whether it actually tells you the uh, result there um, until um, it's finished. Or I mean, I, I think I put it up indefinitely to be honest. So uh, it's probably going to need me to end it. But I don't know whether it shows you what the score is or not at the moment. But uh, but yeah, go along and have a vote, and I'll reveal the um, the result in uh, in a few days' time. Oh, a little bit of curb. Oh dear, I'm all over with the signals here. I have to say, uh, this road crisscrosses this railway line umpteen times. It just keeps twisting back and forth. You really do feel like you're over revving this minibus, you really do. Go on into the next gear. No, it's not going to make it, is it? I have to slow down again. But yeah, really loving this game. Absolutely uh, loving it. I have to say that the more I play with it, the more uh, the more I'm liking it. the the last uh, The last patch uh, certainly did a lot to solve any of the issues. I mean, it, it was playable before, in my opinion. Uh, it didn't take too much away from. The enjoyment of the game but now they've sorted a lot of the issues out it's uh, it's really really good i have to say they've done a real good job and i must make an apology to um whoever is involved with uh tml because um i was actually comparing this to the truck game on the road which i like to keep calling the long road but yeah the truck game on the road and i was kind of um assuming or leading people to believe perhaps that uh, they're the same developers and they're not they're not the same developers uh, i can't remember what they call the on, on there is something like taxtronics or something like that uh, may have got that a bit wrong but uh, it's, it's something like that whereas um, as we probably know it's tml for this one so yeah the developers are totally different so i do apologize for making assumptions there and for comparing the games uh, and mentioning the fact that you know it's kind of I was alluding to the fact that it's the same developer it's not it is the same publisher Aerosoft so it's the same publisher but not the same developers so like I say apologies to anybody concerned there just in case anybody's watching But yeah, going back to the vote, I uh, I put up four because uh, th you can only have a maximum of four options anyway on YouTube. So I put up Fernbus obviously, and uh, OMSI, and Bus Simulator Twenty One, or well, actually any of the bus simulators I put to be honest, They're just just the bus simulator franchise in general and Tourist Bus as well. So uh, yeah, go and pop along to the uh, the channel and. Uh, and put your vote in and I'll probably uh, call an end to it this weekend you see how tight these roads are around here it would be great to uh, to do a, a larger coach around here so I will have to actually have a go at that oh 
hotel coming up on the left. Oh, here's our bus stop on the right. You can see that there. And here we are. Right, let's cancel that signal. And we will get it into neutral. Now we'll actually turn the engine off so that we can hear things a little more clearly. Uh, yeah, we need to open the doors, don't we? <coughs> there we go. And let's go and check these people in. Got a few waiting at this stop. Thank you. Oh. He's not coming with us, he's got the wrong bus. Now I think the problem started with the uh, the volume and me adjusting it slightly was that somebody did comment that uh, they couldn't hear the the game very well and the voices of these passengers because I was uh, I think it was just after the patch and I was <clears throat> showing how the uh, how it was great to uh, to have the people actually talking to us. Um, but like I said, after adjusting things, I don't know whether it was that or just one of those things where things just didn't sync up properly on the recording. I don't know, but. Um, but yeah, uh, it's like I, I said to somebody else, uh, bearing in mind I'm commenting on the game, I'd, I'd rather you hear what I'm saying, uh, assuming that's why you're here, uh, rather than uh, too much of the game and, uh, and not enough of my voice. I, I, I have to say, I don't like uh, watching videos, personally, where you can't hear what they're saying. Uh, I'd much rather hear what they're saying and just watch the video. Uh, whether I can hear the game sounds or not, to me, is less relevant and less important. Well then, some of you may not like my dulcet tones and you'd rather hear the game, I don't know. Let me know in the comments. And if you are enjoying the videos and you uh, are not already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. It doesn't cost you anything. Please give the video a thumbs up. And click that notification bell for more videos. Have a browse through the channel if you've not been here before. Uh, I've got quite a few videos up uh, now of various games. Um, some of which I've not bothered with since the first one because I didn't seem to get a lot of feedback from them. And an awful lot of views to be honest. So, uh, you know, I don't, I don't mind doing a few if somebody particularly requests any. But... Uh, if I don't get a lot of feedback, I don't necessarily mean comments, but just not not a lot of views, then it's really a bit of a waste of time doing them in a sense. But uh, but if somebody has a specific game that uh, they want me to cover again, then I will do. So, right. Where are we? Let's get the engine started. Oh, don't want reverse. And actually, I'll put some lights on while I think about it. Although we're not likely to have any rain today, but you never know. And I think we've got all those on, haven't we? I'm not going to. Though we haven't got an announcement, have we? It's just the navigation monitor, isn't it? So. Right. Yeah, that's the door closed. And off we go. I'd like to just get out of the uh, the bus for a moment at traffic lights and things. It just gives us a, a bit of a, a different perspective. One thing I can't do very well, I've probably mentioned this before, is drive in third person. I've never been a person that can drive in third person perspective very easily. Uh, I, I seem to steer too, too late, I think, uh, for the bends and end up going all over the place. It just doesn't... Uh, it's just how my brain works. So yeah, I tend to uh, to like driving in first person. Oops, quit you up a bit there, mate. You know, had a bit of an AI moment there. We we'll just look at this round here, guys. Oh, there's a little bit of flickering there. I noticed that uh, the other day. I just on that cobble bit there, a little bit of flickering. Well, look at this, guys. Here, absolutely gorgeous. I'm just going to stop the uh, 
stop the bus for a moment and we'll have a good look well look at this here absolutely brilliant it's just like being on holiday isn't it fantastic lovely area around here now whether it's like this in real life i don't know perhaps somebody from around here uh, or who knows the area can comment but uh, but ju just for the game scenery looks absolutely spot on i think they've done a really good job and now that especially now they've sorted a lot of the popping out and the pop out and things like that uh, apart from just back there there's a little bit of glitching going off but uh, but yeah i think they've done a really really top job Now where are we turning off here? Just further down here, isn't it? We should be nearing where we're picking the first passengers up, I would have thought. Although I know we've just just picked up some, haven't we? I forgot about them. Although we should be picking some more up. This is arrival 1025, so we've got a fair way to go yet. Ooker it's Wrong one. But yeah, the, the first time I came round here, I absolutely loved the area. And well, still do. Such a different uh, style of game round, round this area to driving on the motorway all the time. Brilliant. It's what I tend to do on Euro Truck, to be honest, on Euro Truck Sim. Uh, tend to uh, set the sat-nav up to... Um, go on the more minor roads as opposed to the motorways all the time and I much prefer those sorts of roads it just to me makes it more enjoyable rather than just sat on a motorway for half an hour now on that subject does anybody have any idea if you can choose what route you want to take because I can't seem to find a way of selecting the route so back to your road truck for a moment you can you can select um, whether you want it to be the quickest route or the most direct route or whatever. You know, like you do on a real sat nav, really. Um, can't remember whether you can choose various places apart from the towns to uh, to create the routes. You know, like various stops or waypoints or whatever. I'm not sure. I can't remember whether you can do that. I've not been on your truck for a while, actually. Uh, but I've, I've tried clicking on, say, uh, a fuel stop or something like that, and it still won't accept it as a waypoint. So, I, like, for example, I'll just show you what I mean. If, uh, how do we get the map up? Or can we not? No, we may not be able to get the map up. I don't know whether we can or not now. I don't think it's in settings, is it? No. No, I don't know. But in the map, uh, in fact, you can let me know on that if you like, if you can get the map up while uh, while we're in a session. But yeah, you, you you're sort of governed by what the sat nav, uh, what route the sat nav chooses. It's not something that you can choose yourself. And I just think it would be nice to be able to choose uh, a different route if you wanted to go a different route. Now I know, I suppose you could set off and. Um, and just decide to go straight on when you should have turned right or something like that but uh, it'd just be nice to be able to choose a particular route that's all that's what i would think you know what that was on the side of the road there looked like blood This is uh, another stop coming up just around here. But again, this is one of the areas I wanted to show you because uh, it just looks great. More passengers waiting to be picked up. I'm not going to have that long, to be honest. Oh, it's 10.27 now. Departure 10.27. So we better go. 
better get on with things, haven't we? So, let's get some doors open and get the brake on. And let's go and check these passengers in now. Servus, ich hoffe, ich bin hier richtig. Ciao. Rizzi, hier, mein Ticket. Vielen Dank. Thank you. Hallo, bitte sehr. Danke. Mahlzeit, bitte sehr. Okay, ich fast in den falschen Weg eingestiegen. Oh, she's not going with us. Rizzi. Hier, mein Ticket. Vielen Dank. What about you, sir? Kein Problem, ich komme schon zurecht. Oh, let's, uh, let me sort you out first. Oh, you're not going though, are you? Why can't I get this guy? Moin. That's better. I do find when they're close together, it's difficult to uh, talk to the person you want to talk to. Is he not going either? He's not going either, is he? Stood right behind this lady. But yeah, when, they, when, they, when they're close together like that, you just can't... Um, you can't get in properly. Right, I'm just going to have a quick scurry down here. Although that's something else. Has anybody any idea how you can run on this game? I'm not sure you can. Uh, but uh, if you do know of a way. I've tried all the buttons and can't seem to get anything to work. So I don't know. But uh, but yeah. Gorgeous round here isn't it? Lovely looking beach. Fantastic. So yeah. Really enjoying driving around this area. Really, really good. Now, I noticed this before. Uh, I don't know why traffic is building up behind the bus that's sat at a bus stop. You know, you look at all this space here. Look, they've got all that space to get round, and they choose to sit here, causing gridlock. Why they're coming up here in the first place as well, I have no idea. Can we not get in that driver's door? I don't think we can. Oh, we can. Oh, there we go. Didn't know that. So yeah, I don't know why they're all queuing up there when they can get by. Uh, or like I say, why they're coming up here in the first place. I don't know, because there's nothing up here really. Apart from uh, a nice view. But they all turn around and come back down the other way. So uh, yeah, all a bit weird. Uh, why aren't we moving? Handbrakes off. I mean drive. Oh, there's a door. Door sloper, isn't it? That's it. There we go. Nice to see that uh, buses have the safety systems like that. It's a good idea. Things that you don't tend to think of when you just catch a bus. But... Now, they're saying aircon too cold. I've looked on here. I can't find any aircon whatsoever. So I think it's another little... It's either a bug or an oversight in the game where uh, it just... It just tends to ask you, uh, regardless of what vehicle you're driving, um, or, or to tell you that the aircon needs turning to cold. Um, but uh, yeah, this, from what I can see, there's no aircon on this particular minibus. So I'm sorry, passengers, you'll just have to sweat it out. So we need to arrive at, oops, where am I going? Because I'm looking at my dashboard. We need to arrive at uh, 11.03 and we are 8 kilometres away, so that shouldn't be a problem really. I know what I didn't do as well is I didn't press go on here, did I? But uh, I'm not so sure on this shuttle one, I'm not so sure I've actually seen one. I may be wrong, I don't know, but... Uh, but I don't think it matters anyway, if I'm honest. I think once you set off... Uh, there's not a lot you can do about logging in, but um, or, or starting the trip, should I say? 
Uh, but from what I've found out up to now, it doesn't affect your XP or anything, so... It's not a massive problem. Whee! Right. Now I find these giveaways a bit odd as well, when you get a giveaway like that. Now, I know we're talking about on the continent here, and again, somebody may be able to put me right, but in the UK, a giveaway line is tends to be a, either a single or a double broken white line. Uh, whereas here, you seem to get a giveaway triangle. It doesn't actually say giveaway either, it's just a plain triangle, isn't it? An inverted triangle, uh, and the, what appears to be a stop line, which is a solid white line. So I don't know whether the game developers have got that wrong, or whether that is actually how it is on the continent. I don't know. Uh, right, what, what are we doing? I'll turn the engine off again. Let's get the handbrake on so the bus doesn't roll away. Oh, we need the doors opening again, don't we? There we go. Nobody getting off. Blummy neck, they all work at the same place. Must do. Hello everybody. Right, let's get you checked in then. If we can get to a point where we can get it to register. There we go. Is that registering? No, it's not registering. Why are you not registering? It's because she's stood too close to these other people again, isn't it? Oh, add it then. Oh, come on. Very finicky. This is like trying to sort the map out on train life. Let's get you sorted out. We'll be here all bloody day. Thank you. Hello, here is my ticket. Thank you. Servus, Sie wollen bestimmt mein Ticket sehen. Cool. And I can't seem to get her to register either. This is this is weird. Hello. And it has she wouldn't do it from in front, but it's done it from behind, so I don't know I can't understand it. Really weird. Let's see if we can get you from this angle then, yeah, that's worked. Right, I think that's everybody. I think the others are waiting for some other bus, so let's get back on. And get the doors closed. And away we go. It says departure, oh, wait a minute, what we're looking at here just changed, didn't it? So, 10.49, arrival at 11.39, so we should easily do that. Look, they've all queued up again behind the bus, look. So the AI is uh, not particularly strong in that department, is it? Really, they ought to be just driving around you. And like I said, why are they going up there in the first place? I have no idea, because they all go around and then just come straight back out again. <laughs> it's not even like they park up and stop to look at the view or anything. Well, they're all coming back out again. <laughs> oh, well. Let's leave them to it. I'm just looking at that over there as well. You can see through the trees. Let's just come to a stop a moment. There we go. Gorgeous, isn't it? Lovely area. I mean, I'm sure there's other nice areas on the map. I've uh, not really completed a lot of the map, but... But, yeah. Well, loving it around here. I can see this being an area that I frequent quite regularly. Ooh. 
That was close. Zinovitz. Is it this way we're finishing? I can't remember now. I can't remember where the final place was. Must be a way of getting the map up. Yeah, thank you. I wonder. It is. It's that. It's the um, the two little square button, the uh, select button, if you like. So uh, I forgot what I was going to look at on here now. To be honest, I can't remember why I was looking on here. I think it, I think it was just looking at saying that on the uh, Saturday, if you set off a certain way, you could perhaps look on here. And let's say if you didn't want to go this way. Let's say you're going up to here, and it took you around here. You could get to this junction just past Uzadon there, and uh, and then just take that left turn, couldn't you? You could just do it yourself, I suppose. But it would be nice to just be able to click on there and say, no, I want to go that way, not the way you're telling me to go. But um, they may implement that at some point, I don't know. Oh, there's our bus stop. Oh no, it's not the final place then, is it? We've got uh, some more to pick up, by the looks of it. I was thinking Zinovitz was our final one, but I don't think it is then. Whee! I'm sure the passengers will be loving that. Wrong one. Right, few more to pick up here. Hallo, ich hoffe, ich bin hier richtig. Auf geht's. And let's get this guy done. If we can. There we go. Thank you. And you, madam. Thank you. Get these guys from this side, I think. Is he? Oh, he's not going. He's not got a ticket, has he? Like he's going. And Hallo, Sie wollen bestimmt mein Ticket sehen. Auf geht's. Just you here, isn't there? Danke sehr. And then you. Just sorted your twin sister out. Oh, triplets. No, she's not going. What about you, madam? Can we sort you out yet? No. Can't seem to get to this person here. Oh. What was that then? There we go. Yeah, I don't know whether they can make that just a little easier. Some little house around here, aren't there? Lovely place like this. Look at all the crap. Bloody hell. Right. Well, back on. Okay, <laughs> so we're going to be well early, aren't we? 11.09 we're supposed to be departing. Uh, sorry, 11.41 I should say we're departing. It's 11.09 at the moment, but uh, anyway. Let's get on with it. I'm not hanging about. It's the AC to cold again, but uh, I'm shaking like an autumn leaf. Oh! 
So th yeah, that's a bit odd then, isn't it? So it's the game's telling me to turn the AC to cold, and yet somebody's saying they're shaking like an autumn leaf, which now leads me back to believe I had this sort of thought when the game first came out, and I was thinking that it, sh it, it was reading too cold and the developers had missed a no-off, so it should be too T double O cold. Uh, and then I thought, no, it must be the game telling me to turn it to cold. But now that's just made me think again because she said shaking like a leaf, which implies she's cold. And and yet the game can't be then telling me to turn the aircon to cold. That doesn't make sense. So perhaps it is telling me that it's too cold and they've missed a no off. I don't know. Oops, where are we going there? With a nice little area here with a nice bridge look. Fantastic stuff. Let's just get out of the uh, the cabin a bit. Let's have a little look round. Brilliant, isn't it? Fantastic. Oh, thank you, Chester. I think he's seen pussycats in the bike. I meant to have shut the door actually, but uh, forgot all about it. If you're wondering what type of dog he is, if you've heard him before, perhaps he's uh, a border terrier. And we've had him for five years now from a puppy. Go on, get out of the way. Are you taking your chance as well about the next one? No. <laughs> that that amuses me. It says vehicle off road, and I think it's the speed bumps uh, that that cause that trigger. Um, it obviously thinks that because the uh, the vehicle's been bumped around, I must be driving off road. So yeah, quite a, another little quirk of the game. You think it'd go on what a, area of the map I'm driving on, not uh, not just the fact that I'm going over a bump. But uh, anyway, see here again. Look, nice, nice little shops, and uh, well, I say little shops, some look quite big, I suppose, but nice cobbled areas. Why am I waiting? I don't know. Why am I waiting? Get on with it, mate. Get on with it. Oh, it says arrival 1221. How did you say 1121 earlier on? I don't know whether the time's playing tricks with me. You know what? But, uh... It was... It was 10 past 11, wasn't it? And it said arrival at 11.21. Now it's saying 12.21. So I don't know what's happening there. Yes, we're already here. Ah, Volgas, that's where I was finishing, isn't it? So there you go, madam. Quickest journey you've ever had to Volgas. If that's how you say it. Always conscious of that, you know. I hate pronouncing things wrong. Right, let's get the parking brake on and turn everything off into neutral engine off. We will open. Oh, no, we've already opened the doors, haven't we? I think. Have we? Yes, we have. Everybody's off. We're sorted. So, can we check out now then? We can. So, let's complete. And let's just have a quick look through here then. So economy, we've got all greens and whites. So no problems there. Service. Yep, yeah, big tick four on the schedule. Traffic rules. Yeah, we've got green all the way. Am I going to get a full house? Ah, oh, no. Ah. 
Do you know what I bet that was? I bet that was when it thought I was driving off the road when I went over that speed bump. Ah, oh, that's so pissing off, isn't it? Bloody hell. Never mind. Right, okay, so we have 318 XP from this, and we now have a total of 600, uh, sorry, 6,178 XP. So, uh, right, well, that's it. That's another trip. Yeah, get yourself over this end, uh, guys, if you want to explore a little bit more. It's a really lovely area of the map, and I'm really enjoying driving around it. It'll be interesting to see what it's like in a bigger bus. Perhaps uh, one of you guys will try it and uh, stick it down in the comments. Don't forget the uh, Discord uh, channel, by the way. Uh, I'll put a link in the description. And uh, please uh, give the video a thumbs up. It really does help with the channel and get the video spread around the massive world of YouTube uh, and helps me grow the channel. It doesn't cost you anything. Please subscribe and click that notification bell. And uh, yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed it and we will catch you on the next video. So take care. Bye for now.